I think we have time for a couple more questions and one has been floating to the top here. It's a little bit off topic, um, but certainly a big deal for Florida Poly. So I'm gonna ask everyone, we'll do it a little bit lightning round style. What would be your ideal Florida Poly mascot? Starting with Dana. Um, oh man, there's a lot of good ideas floating around on campus right now. But I'd have to say probably uh, Poly Pioneers. Poly Pioneers. Christy, um, if you have any ideas off the top of your head for us, what do you think? Oh man, I haven't even thought about mascots in years. Dana, what were some of the other, what were some of the other options? Can I have multiple choice? <laughs> I mean, sure. So some of the the bigger uh, hitters were uh, the Hydras, which uh, is like sure. the, the mythological creature from like Greek mythology. Uh, the the monster with the multiple heads that Hercules was like cutting off, um, as well as uh, oh my gosh, I'm drawing a blank. Crystal, <laughs> I'll help you out. I'll help you. <laughs> <laughs> what was that, Chrissy? You You're voting for the Hydra? Yep. <laughs> All right. Lauren, do you have any any favorites out there? You know, I think that they're all very unique. Um, definitely the mascots that the students are um, debating over right now are things that I probably never would have even thought of. Um, so I'm not I'm not sure, I'm not partial to just one. I think that the students will decide something wonderful and um, will be very representative of Fuller Poly, so. Thanks, and Ryan, what about you? Any favorites? Uh, well, you know, I, I... I think they're like, like uh, Lauren said, there are probably a lot of good ones. Um, I was leaning towards uh, Prometheus, you know, but uh, you know, that's just me. I thought it would have been a, a very appropriate choice. A little sad it wasn't the option, one of the options. Uh, so, but that's okay. I'll get over it. So for, for anyone watching who, um, who doesn't know, um, actually one of the, the great things that our inaugural class is getting to do right now is actually pick the university's mascot. And, um, and students have come up with uh, an array of concepts and we're going through a, a voting process. So in early March, students are going to vote on their favorite concepts and on April 22nd, we'll reveal the university's mascot. So it's something fun that we're doing um, and stay tuned. And it's been more than just a, a creative process. It's also been a hands-on learning process for students. Thank <laughs> you.